visuals that we're getting you on your screen coming in from Brahmapuram in Kerala. And the state government has now issued an alert and requested all the residents around this area to stay indoors. And even when they are indoors, the state government has requested that the doors and windows must be shut. Vivek is joining me live right now to get us more details. Uh, Vivek, good morning. This is uh, serious because the Kerala state government is not leaving anything to chance. They have put an alert across that all those people around the area of Brahmapuram in Kerala, due to the smoke that is emanating from the waste plant, must stay indoors. And even when they are indoors, they should keep their doors and windows shut. How serious is the situation on ground? What is going to be the plan of action for the state government to try and mitigate this crisis at hand? Uh, yes, uh, right now this, uh, the fire and rescue team and also the, the 30 uh, odd fire units that's been deployed in Brahmapuram is, uh, you know, into uh, removing the waste, uh, especially the plastic waste out, sir, and trying to pump water, uh, you know, once they have removed that plastic waste and, and to, in trying to ensure that the small patches of fire that is emanating from different parts of this 110 acres of waste piles uh, has completely stopped. Now, even as we speak right now, the fire has completely stopped, but the problem is, you know, the dioxins, gaseous substances that has been emanated, you know, uh, underneath uh, this, uh, you know, uh, pile of waste dump yard. That is the major problem. Remember, this, uh, you know, dioxins are basically very poisonous chemicals uh, that come, that is formed when organic substances is mixed with half, uh, you know, uh, homogenated plastics like PVC, and it is indeed very, very dangerous. A lot of, uh, you know, scientists and environmentalists have already warned that even uh, in the earlier years, there is uh, this presence of dioxins in, uh, in the atmosphere in Ernakulam, especially when the uh, plastic uh, and the waste is burning in Brahmapuram. Now, the Kerala Fire and Rescue uh, is now engaged in an unparalleled mission at Brahmapuram with about 200 firefighters from Kannur to Tiruvannathapuram are engaged in firefighting in for 24 hours. Now, what the sources are saying is that the smoldering plastic waste in 70% of the area that caught fire has been doused and the works are on to extinguish the smoke in the remaining 30% of the area. Now, district collector NSK Umesh, uh, who assumed the office, uh, says uh, that he visited the site along with uh, MLA PV Srinijan and Corporation Mayor Emmanuel Kumar. He also said that all need to work together uh, to douse uh, the, uh, you know, the flames that is arousing. Remember, there has been a number of uh, you know, complaints, especially regarding respiratory complaints uh, and other health issues like burn on the skin and also scratching issues, uh, uh, cough uh, and other breathing respiratory issues that is shown uh, among the young children, especially between the age of 7 and 17, you know, in and around uh, Brahmapuram area. And that is the reason why the collector has also, uh, you know, called for a holiday for all schools, you know, uh, schools from one, one fifth, first standard to seventh standard. This indeed is a major issue. It's not the fire that is uh, causing, uh, you know, which is a major concern here. It is the smoke and the gaseous substances and the particles, uh, poisonous particles and substances that's emanated from here because these are all plastic waste. 70% of it are plastic waste. Now, when plastic, half, uh, uh, you know, burnt plastic is mixed with organic waste, it is the dioxins that's been produced. And these dioxins are extremely harmful for human beings. And that's the reason, that's a major concern right now. Now, remember, earlier there was a commission that's been set up by the Kerala High Court. Absolutely, uh, you know, Vivek, and uh, thank you for joining us with all those uh, details, Vivek. And we shall come back to you to get more updates on the story.